good Friday morning, everybody. Welcome to my daily vlog. So we made it. It's the weekend. As you can see, I am back in the shirt and tie. I've got my second in-person interview this morning. So I'm actually on my way there now. I've got that going on this morning, and I'm going to change and go to go to work. Well, change at work, I should say. Yeah. Um, looks like it takes about 15, 20 minutes to get there on the metro, so this shouldn't be too bad. We gotta take the red line to the yellow line. It's in Crystal City. It's hot, sorry. It is really hot already this morning. I'm out here in this damn tie. It is what it is. Cannot do anything about it. It is summertime. Really looking forward to the weekend. Paul finally, finally has his ID. So, I'm thinking maybe we go out on Saturday night. Maybe we'll see how things roll, how things plan out. But now that he has an official ID, he can go out, which is awesome. He is really, really official now. So it's exciting. Could it be seriously? <laughs> be all up on me. Yeah, it was a very chill night last night. I didn't really do anything. It wasn't really anything on TV, but I feel very rested again today. It's good. It's no going to be another crazy day at work. It was almost to the point of chaotic yesterday. It just felt like no matter what I did, I couldn't get anything done. And then having to leave early just made that even worse. I just left a whole bunch of shit to do today. <laughs> so yeah, it's going to be a busy one. All right, so leaving the interview, um, I don't think I got it, honestly. I don't think I bombed the questions. I just don't think I'm what they're looking for. Uh, it seems like they are looking for somebody with a little more management experience than what I've got. So yeah, unfortunately, I just don't think I got it. Um, it is what it is. If I get it, great. If I don't, all right. I really do hope though that I got the position that I went to yesterday. That I'm definitely pulling for a little more than this. Whew, getting out here was tough. I forgot how hard it is to get to Crystal City during rush hour. <laughs> it takes a lot longer than what I thought it would. Um, but, yeah, um, I'm not hopeful about this one, unfortunately. So, on to work. Ooh, it's hot. <laughs> uh, get into work, change into some more casual clothes, because it is Friday, so it's casual Friday. And then move on with this day. Um... It's funny because at the end of the interview, she blatantly said, oh, well, we've got other people that we're interviewing. Well, that doesn't give me hope. And you'll probably hear back from us in two to three weeks. I'm like, wow, okay. So, all right. <laughs> so we'll see. All right, moving on. So 
good evening. We just had a crazy ass thunderstorm blow through. Apparently it was actually so crazy that uh, I guess a tree fell onto the tracks or somehow hit uh, a metro train on the orange line. Not entirely sure, but yeah. <laughs> Pretty crazy ass storm just blew through here. Um, yeah. I haven't heard anything back from yesterday's interview or today's interview, but I'm suspecting I probably won't hear anything back for a little bit at least. I was hoping to hear something back today from yesterday's because the recruiter kind of gave me the impression that um, they're usually pretty quick about letting them know, but didn't hear anything. So we'll see. Tonight is a chill night. One, because of this weather. <laughs> it's actually still raining right now. One question though, I don't know if this is just a DC thing. I guess I don't, I haven't traveled enough to know, but why? Why do people walk around with umbrellas up and open when it was raining? And what I mean is like, okay, so it was raining earlier. It's like drizzling now. But when I left work, it wasn't raining. And yet walking from work to the metro, I saw so many people with their umbrellas up and open. In fact, one lady was actually fucking <laughs> blocking the escalator on the left-hand side because of her umbrella. And I, she finally realized what she was doing. I wanted to tap on her umbrella and be like, excuse me, it's not raining. But she finally realized what she was doing. And I'm like, oh yeah, thank you. By the way, it's not raining. <laughs> and walked by her. It wasn't raining. Why the fuck is your umbrella open and out when it's not raining? And I saw so many people with this. It was not raining at that current moment. It was raining earlier, but it wasn't raining. <laughs> I, 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 don't, I don't get it. Like, put your fucking umbrella away. You're just taking up space and you're holding this umbrella and then here's another, here's what made it worse too. So <laughs> there's an, an area walking towards the metro where it always floods when it rains. And this mother had a stroller and I guess she'd gotten stuck and she was trying to go up some stairs. And instead of like putting the umbrella down so she could try to get up the stairs with the stroller and someone had came to help her get up the stairs. She's like holding the umbrella with her shoulder like it's a phone and trying to hold the stroller and I'm looking at her and I'm like it's not raining and if you really need to get her up the stairs or get the stroller up the stairs why not just put the umbrella down <laughs> just for a second like I, I people fascinate me <laughs> when it comes to just using their brain I don't think people stop and think a lot. And it really bothers me because I can't deal with stupidity. I don't like when people just don't think for a moment. Use your fucking brain. <laughs> like, oh, let me think, what would be easier? Let me put this umbrella down so I can actually deal with this. Even if it was raining, your main focus should be that child in that stroller, not whether or not you're gonna get wet. <laughs> it's raining right now, in case you couldn't tell. It's a drizzle. And it's funny too because normally this drizzle would bother me. Well, I shouldn't say normally. Once upon a time, this drizzle would bother me. I'd be like, oh my god, where's my umbrella? But living in Seattle, even though it was a very brief period, definitely taught me that this type of rain does not constitute an umbrella you're not getting wet you're not getting, you're not getting wet enough for an umbrella yeah you may be a little a little moist 
but it's not wet enough to have an umbrella. People here, man, if it even looks like it should be raining, they pull out this fucking umbrella. <laughs> So as right now, this actually kind of feels good, considering it's been a hot day, I'm sweaty. It's like a shower before I go home and shower. 